King Charles and Queen Camilla's constant battle exposed after fallouts over basic issue. The Queen's sister Annabel Elliot revealed King Charles and Queen Camilla's frequent row about a minor thing, and the king usually wins. Welcome to Royal Pancakes. If you are new here, please don't forget to subscribe and click the notifications bell, so you don't miss any news about the British monarchy. All couples squabble, be it over household chores, money or even whose turn it is to put the bins out. And it's been revealed that King Charles and Queen Camilla are no different, with a constant battle over something that might strike a chord in households across the UK. In royal biographer Robert Hardman's new book about King Charles the Queen's sister Annabel Elliot says that their most frequent row is about room temperature. Mr. Hardman writes, as a couple however, they are both very happy to indulge each other's pet habits, such as compulsive window opening in the case of the king. There's a constant battle about it, says Annabel Elliot. He will have opened it and she will creep in behind and shut it. So there's a lot of oh darling you've shut the window. Yes I have because we're all freezing, a lot of banter like that goes on. The Queen's sister Annabel Elliot revealed the pair's frequent row about a minor thing, and the King usually wins. But Ms Elliot says, although the King usually manages to get his own way on the minor domestic issue, her sister usually rules the roost in other areas. She added, if the king usually wins on that front, says his sister-in-law, Queen Camilla wins most other things. The king will need Queen Camilla's support more than ever in the coming weeks as recovers from treatment for an enlarged prostate. His health conditions came just hours after it was revealed that Princess Kate was in hospital recovering from abdominal surgery. Now it's reported that the Queen has issued a warning to her husband after the prostate procedure that will see him take a step back from public engagements. Charles, 75, was seen for the first time since the procedure on his Sandringham estate in Norfolk, where he is thought to be recuperating there following the operation. An insider said, the Queen has told him he needs to slow down a bit, the Sun reports. The NHS England website on benign prostate enlargement received 26,170 visits in the 48 hours after the announcement, compared to a daily average of just 1,400. King Charles had 516 engagements last year, including 94 that took place abroad.